What's going on, guys? Uh, haven't done a video in a very long time, but decided to do a Minecraft video because we're playing on a friend server. It's our friend Dan, who um, also is a friend of the second Matt, whose server we first started playing on and then got kicked off. But I am joined by Matt and Dan right now, and currently we are just building up. We started this a little late because we didn't realize, oh, hey, that's right, we can record it. <laughs> kind of fell out of YouTube, but that's what I've got going over there. Dan's over there on the mountain, and uh, he found a pretty cool spot. It's uh, it's an interesting little cave system. I plan on doing a whole village, sort of. Kind of like, um, well, what's the thing called? Well, no, because that's actual underground, but, oh, City of Ember. That old book that got turned into a kind of bad movie and was mediocre at best, but the book was pretty nice, but I got a little thing in here. I have yet to grab a bed. Uh, chickens are everywhere, but I haven't found sheep yet. So we're going to go see what Dan's up to, and so we are also joined by uh, one of his friends, Joe, who is an amazing designer. I'll show you his bridge he built. But it's a lot of jumping, and we're going to be working on this whole thing, this whole mound, and just making it look completely spectacular. All in create. All in uh, survival. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, not creative. Creative. My mind is very creative. I always think of creative mode. Yep. Very true. Anyway, here's the bridge. I was actually on here when Joe first started it, and it was just solid wood, nothing else. And then I came on here a couple hours later and he added this in. And it looks pretty sweet. I said, he actually cut it off and... Oh, that's cool. I didn't even see that at first. It continues down over there and he sort of flattened it out. And then over there it sort of stops because of the building, uh, because of the side of the mountain. It's going to connect the two mountains together. Yeah, we're going to have pathways and roads and stairs. and It's going to be Mountain City. So they've got... Uh, Joe has this side of the mountain for himself. Oh, oh. Dan has that side of the mountain on the other side of the... Um, of the uh, bridge. And I've got the cave in that mountain all the way over there, so... We're pretty close, yet somewhere somewhat spread apart. So we'll go in here and I'll show you uh, Dan's interesting layout, I guess. But it's still pretty cool. Symmetrical. As much as Oh, possible. you got two of these? Yes. One goes down, one goes up. Ah. Interesting. The other one's not as done, so... Yeah, I just checked that. Oh, there's Dan. Grab more pickaxes. Pony boy. So yeah, we just started it up and it's like, yeah, we really want to build something now. Dead end hallway. And uh, this is his current project. He's hollowing this out for... Uh, Wheat and uh, sugar cane. Oh, okay. It's going to be a, basically a farm, water, uh, and then it's going to go up. There's going to be some branching, and then it's going to go up to the top, and there's going to be basically where I keep all my trees for wood. This is currently what I'm working on scaffolding-wise. I'm building the light system for the whole thing. <laughs> it's going to be like a dome. Yeah, we've had a, 
Another reason we haven't really been doing server videos and videos at all is we've been having horrible luck. We were on uh, the second Matt server and um he kind of got mad, wasn't it? Well, no, it wasn't he got mad. It's that the server was buggy. Oh and yeah, yeah. Crazy because yeah. I did that I did a couple floating islands and a uh, what? And yeah, I got what I've, what I've heard some people call a mage tower of sorts, and we came back in, and we With saw God. it. And, and I look, and I'm like, "What's missing here? Hey, where's my island?" And then I walked over there. I thought it was just a chunk lag, and so I disconnected and then reconnected. And yeah, it was completely taken apart. There was only like, I would say a tenth of it left. And it took me at least like three hours to do it. Oh, that was infuriating. So then we thought, oh, yeah. okay, so we moved to another location that shouldn't happen again. And we built an underwater dome. And we thought, okay, yeah, this is cool, this is cool. And then that's when we got kicked off. Yeah. Then I was so. just creating some stuff on a solo server. I forget what I was doing. I think you were playing Borderlands 2. I don't have Borderlands 2. Or just Borderlands then. Yeah. I have Borderlands 2. Never played it. Yet. Yeah, we might start that, that up too this week. Yeah, that seems to be the case with everyone. Namely, you two, because both of you, I guess, have it. And have it. I haven't even gotten it though, so I haven't even gotten that far. Well, I've told everybody's like, "Oh my gosh, Borderlands is the best!" Yada yada yada, and I just been like, "All right, whatever." It's a good game. I play it in spurts. Like, I'll play it and then go like a whole month without playing it, and I'll play it a little bit more, and so on. And, and when we play it, it's like for hours on end. Yeah, it's like a binge of. You play it for like 16 hours straight. Well, I mean, not that long. I think, well, when we went and finished it, I think we played it for what, like five, six hours that one night? We played it all night. Yeah, we finished it at like 3 a.m. And we started at, when did we start? I think we started like right at 10. Yeah, because it was like the, the day before you came over and we hung out. And we're like, hey, let's play Borderlands. And we got, like, to the last, I guess, chapter, if you would. And we thought, okay, well, tomorrow we can finish it after I get out of work. Never and, did. And, Never know, did. We did. Oh. We did. Um, I got out of work at, like, 9 or 9.30, and I came home and got situated, and then... <clears throat> oh. oh, I'm getting hit because of I'm starving. <laughs> then it got situated, and we started at like ten, and yeah, we didn't finish till like three or four that night. So yeah, that was about five or six hours. Yeah, and I didn't even play it again until like yesterday. <laughs> yeah. Wow. So. And then we started up and playing uh, the Zombie, uh, Island track. Zombie Island of Doctor Ned. And you started getting off track. <laughs> um, I have some apples if you want. Some trees that I've got now chopped down. No, I'm good. I'm still waiting for this stupid tree. I, I don't get it. There was a tree that grew in here before. And now it won't. And it's getting on my nerves. Maybe I just have to move it's it. It's because of the different sizes. If a tree is too large, it won't grow. Well, yeah, but that's not the way the coating works. The coating works. It goes through cycles. And when it hits a cycle that goes true, that's when the tree grows. But if it go, grows false, then it won't grow. Well, if it grows false, then... Yeah, 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 no. 
Um, I just noticed that you have to have a lot of space for trees to grow. Yeah, a little bit. You need like, it needs to be a really large area actually. Like, it's annoying if you have it underground and dig it out because it's seriously an insanely large area. Yeah, well, for I just got... one tree. For just one tree too. I've got like, it, three spaces on one side, five spaces on the other side. I could probably actually move that over. You should really have a square that's about mm, five by five. No, even bigger. No, like a ten by ten square per tree, and it needs to be like twenty tall. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No, nope. ten. Yeah. Because, I mean, trees aren't that big. They go up... No, there's a, I've seen some trees, depending on it, they've gone up. Well, yeah, the super trees and all, but that's but not... But you can cycle through those, and if one of those trees happens to be that tree is going to grow into that, it won't grow at all. It doesn't have the room to grow. It's annoying. I've dealt with trees underground before. They're really annoying to do. Yeah, this one only goes up like five high. Yeah, I've I've seen the monster trees and those are just psychotic. No, those are jungle trees. Not jungle no, trees. No, not the jungle trees. I'm talking oh, about yeah, the, the, ones with, the ones that actually start to get branches and stuff. Those are the big ones. Yeah. Those grow to be like 10, 15 high. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Yeah, this one's what? Three, four, five, six, seven. I had, yeah, I had a seven block tree in there. I I don't know. I, I don't get it. I mean, I changed it and actually made it bigger than what it was before. And now it won't grow. <laughs> it's just I normally annoying. use bone meal to grow my trees fast if I need one. There's trees outside. And I have wood if you need that, what you need. I oh, know I'm good. It's just I have like I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get it. I'm trying to get it inside, so that way I don't have to keep coming out here where I can just stay down there and oh, do like, everything. I mean, I have wood. I mean, I have like oh, I don't know how many stacks of what I have. A lot, like at least five, six fours. Yep. Just wood plank. I believe it. I gotta use a ton of it though to make more fences and stuff. Yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do with this uh, thing. I don't even know what it is. 